Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a get ready with me, so just keep watching. I'm going to start by using the Glam Glow Illuminating Moisturizer. Next up, I'm going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow, of course, and I'm going to be filling in my eyebrows. Next, we're going to be using the CoverGirl Eye Concealer in the shade 340. Now that I have that done, I'm going to be blending out my concealer with a little beauty blender. Now I'm going to be setting it with the Airspun Translucent Powder. I brought you guys a bit closer so you can see exactly what I'm doing, but I'm going to be using the 25B palette and I'm going to be going in on the second shade down on the first row. And I'm just blending that into my crease. I'm going to be using the Morphe 35R palette and I'm going to be using the first shade. I'm just going to be placing the shade on top of the other one and blending them together. I'm going in with the Tarte Toasted Palette and the shade Fireside. Now I'm going to be taking that shade and I'm going to be blending on the outer corner and the inner corner and a little bit on top but not in the middle. Now that I've done that, I'm going to be blending it out with the Morphe M441 brush. After that, I'm going to be taking the last shade on the first row and I'm going to be applying that to my lid. I have really straight lashes, so I'm going to be curling the top and the bottom. I am now applying the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, the waterproof one, and it's just like the mini travel size. I applied mascara to the top and bottom lashes, and now I'm going to be using the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner to line my waterline. Now for the face part, I'm going to be going in with the Fit Me Foundation Stick. And it is a bit too light for me, so I will be using it as a concealer. So I'm just going to be applying it to spots where I need concealer at. Now I'm going to be going in with the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in the shade Cream Beige. I'm now taking my Real Techniques Beauty Blender and I'm going to be blending that out smoothly. I will now use the Air Spun Translucent Powder to set my foundation and concealer. going in with the Betty Luminizer bronzer and maybe bronzing my cheeks and around my face. Then I'm using the Sephora brand highlighter. A little trick is if you spray Mario Badesco on your brush, your highlighter stays on way longer throughout the day. <music> Lastly, I'm placing the highlighter on my nose and on my cupid's bow. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.